something I want to try. Oh, by the way, hello all the awesome people out there. My name is Akira and welcome back to this let's play of Limbo. But I figured there's something I didn't do before actually when I was here. So the elevator is around. Oh no, I don't have to place it by the elevator. I have to place it by the ladder. Uh, but I figured I could get down again by using this here. So the gun couldn't shoot me. So I will just do that because there's something I actually forgot to uh, test out before. That I actually want to do. And that was when um, I got to the ladder. Uh, not the ladder, the elevator. I totally forgot to test one single little thing. And that is... No! Oh, God dang it. It's not supposed to go in. I want to here. This one down. Because I can get over on the other side. Uh, I just noticed when I was uh, rendering the video. That if I do it like this, this one can't shoot me. There's no way. So if I get on top of this and jump over here. There's something. What do we have here? Ooh, we have a box. So I think... Yeah, that makes sense now. I actually need another box to complete the puzzle before. I just have to find a way to get this out. I think I have to do it like this. Some way. This is going to take some time. Because one thing this game is has not is... Um, no margin of error at all. You have to do it perfectly. Ah, oh, so close. Okay, so I have to release it around the bump down here. Like there. And then gravity off. Oh, that was so close. Because if it hit the ceiling, it will get back again. So around there. Oh, come on. Uh, I, think, I, I think I have the launch pattern right here. I have to get it there and just there we go because if I place it over here then I think when I turn on the gravity on the other side um, that will do what I have to do so also that makes sense why I actually uh, could push it on top here it didn't make sense to me first I think I pushed it up here before so and then just got it down or else I got it from up there I can't remember now but it makes sense now because I need another box. And I was an idiot not to realize that before. Um But there we can just do it in my second. But now when I do this, I will get my first box here. And that I can just take all the way over here. Something like this. And then I hope that the other box also got up and get placed over there because I was running all the way over here before and that's all I could actually got pretty, get pretty far yeah there it is so that should be able to get me over that the other thing wow that was a big puzzle um, but yeah I just noticed when I was um, editing the video so that's actually why I did that but now it all makes sense so the only thing I have to do now is actually get this a little further there. And that is around here. And then just wait for this thing to go, it, go in. And then when it starts to go out again, right there, I will drop down and hopefully get all the way over. There we go. Ugh, that puzzle took way longer than it should have done. But I'm already saying it in the last week episode, so... Yeah. What was that? So, what do we have here? Uh, big box. Okay. So... Okay, so this thing keeps the big box up there. That was easy enough. And then I can... Oh. Um, 
Oh. Not as easy as a four. Okay, this is the only way I can get up there, but I have to get this one down, but the only way I can see if I can turn it off is if I get down again. Unless... Can I climb? No. Nope. Um, maybe I don't have to turn this on right now. Only the gravity. Uh, that doesn't enable me to get up there though. Okay, so I have to do something here. Because now the gravity is not on, that means when I press this one they'll both fall down. And that's the only way I can see... Oh, one of them has a longer path up than the other one, so... Oh, it hit. But I think that's actually the trick here, that you have to make sure that one of them only get up and the other one don't, so... Like that. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so on Earth, we. I'm doing good today. There we go. Okay, so that's. Okay, so it has little time before it loosens. Like this. There we go. Um, <laughs> I got impaled. Okay, this one is not that hard though. I just still don't remember to jump off. That was too much. Or not. Just remember to get off there. I don't want to get impaled again. What the hell? Who thought that was a good idea? Damn it! <sighs> wow. They have really a lot of the puzzles that involve gravity in this game. God dang it, that was my own fault. There we go. And there we go. Oh god, I have to get back to that. And down. Is this stationary? Yeah, I think so. Okay, I don't think I have to use that for anything, so... Oh god! I know what that is! It's something that will kill me! That also will kill me. Uh, these, uh, uh, the signs that are in the level, I have to get to them. That one over there, so that will change the gravity. And then I need that box. Oh god. I didn't think that it would be a time puzzle. Oh, 
I was so close. How am I supposed to do that? Uh, because what I saw, I really don't have that much time to do any of the things I have to do here. Because then it will just fall down. What? Is there anything I'm missing here? Let's just see. Can I get up here again? Nope. I'm lost down here forever. Oh, maybe, 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 maybe. I'm an idiot. Get the box as far as you can. Get over on the other side. When I drop down, I can change the gravity again, of course. Like that. Just make sure you don't hit the box in the head. There we go. And once more, just make sure that everything is perfect. Okay, I can't do it any better than this, so... Ah, oh, so close! Oh, <laughs> I had it! I was there! God dang it. How can you be so close and then fail? Okay, there we go, just run. Also, I actually forgot when I had to jump up here, I had to press down and not up. So there we go, and there. Okay, so what I have to do here is I have to get to that. down there as fast as possible. Only when time is almost. Damn it! I need a little more time to do this. And down there. But I was doing it uh, the right way. There we go. And... Damn it! Okay, I was standing in the right place, so... <laughs> I just didn't hit the button. Direction to that way, then I just die. Oh 
or maybe I don't have to press that at all. Just have to go under here. Ah, uh, so close! But I don't see a reason why to push that button because... I'll just die. But the most irritating thing now is actually this music. Change the direction of there, just die no matter what. I'm dead and I'm not at all. I just think they is there to confuse me. Uh, it's not enough how to back I'm not supposed to do this. Maybe Kills me when I push it. Like that. I just got electrocuted. No matter what. So I'm not supposed to go that way at all. And up there, I'll die when I hit the ground. <sighs> That's not enough. How? <laughs> that was more of a coincidence that I actually did that. <laughs> oh, that looks so amazing. And again, that would hurt a lot to do that. <laughs> also, like the ragdoll physics there. <laughs> but to think that a fault, like what? I will let Mister Made is a kid, so he may be like. 1 meter 50 or something so he just fall like 20 meters so <laughs> that would have hurt a lot just to hit the ground like that so was that it or can I please get up oh It'll also be a really weird ending, because it's not an ending. But I still w will want to know what he's, what's going on. How much do we still need? Oh. It actually looks like the ending here. So... Is there any conclusion at all? I still don't know what's going on with the worms and all that. There's someone here, and I'm not in control anymore, so... Was that it? What? Okay. So I ran through all that just to get to a girl. Or what? Um, <laughs> I'll just see what's after the credits here if there's anything at all. I'm curious. What the. Not that it's a bad game, not at all. It just.
Yeah, as I said, it was the Danish company that had made it. So... I can hear something, but... Okay, that's apparently the end. Well, okay. <laughs> so, that game ended way different than I had expected. But okay, if you think about, for those of you who have seen Inside, uh, that also has like an ending, but not really an ending. Like, you can make up what you want of the world. It didn't give you a conclusion in the end where it says that's how it is. It's like they show the world and they show you a person that runs through that world to get to an end, but it didn't give you the conclusion what's going on or anything. You can make up your own thoughts about that. So, but what I know about Limbo is uh, that's a play in between when you're dead and you're between everything. Like you're you're not supposed to be there or another place, but you're just a lost soul, and maybe. It, that's what you can take of this game, that it's a lost soul that's trying to, to to get to the end, to get out of where he is. And it's a struggle all the way through, but at the end you come to what, what, you, what you need. And for him it was to get to that girl that maybe represented something after. And that's how he get away from Limbo. Um, that would be my guess, uh, but you can make up your own theories about that, and I'm pretty sure this is an older game, like I said in the beginning. Um, and you can make up your own conclusion, and there probably are many people who have theorized about what this is, and... I also think that the worms represent something that's trying to take control of you, so you don't escape uh, this place here at all. And they, they, they try to drag you back. Because every time I get to a worm, they actually were trying to go backwards and they were afraid of the light. So maybe I tried to escape, find my light and get away from here. So that's my thought about that game. But yeah, it's it's a real good game actually. I, I, I enjoyed it the whole way through. So, um, But as I said also when I started playing this game, I will also pray. Uh, pray. I will also pray. I will also play um, Inside when... I have forgotten what the story about Inside was because, as I said, it's two months or so since I saw someone play it and I can't remember the whole story and all the puzzles more or less. So, and I want to complete the game without knowing how to complete the puzzles, so maybe in a year's time or so I will play it and pick it up. Uh, because I think it's funnier for me to play games when I don't know how to solve puzzles when it's a puzzle game. Um, not like fighting games or anything like that where you have to be good at it and to get through the story. But with puzzle games, it's not fun if you know all the puzzles right off the bat. Uh, it's funny I have to try and arrow and try to figure them out for yourself. And if you can remember the puzzles, it's no fun at all. So, but I ramble on long enough about this. Um, so, I will just end this video here and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos and I hope you all will have an awesome day. So, until next time. Farewell. Since nobody's around, we feel to look in with Sarah's desk. Sarah's desk. Oh, come on! This isn't time for that. Look at what's happening to the school. Look, top drawer. Packed with love letters to Miss uh, Tilly because that's a be his price. So, but as you can see, Mario is already out. Um, I knew he could have it because he's not that strong, but uh, he gained one more level, so he's level 43 now. Uh, Link is...